previously on Yu-Gi-Oh! Art 5. The duel between the duel tainer extraordinaire Yuya Sakaki and flawless fortune teller and prodigious predictress Aura Sentia is about to begin! My fortune telling abilities are never wrong. With it, I'll learn if you're truly destined to be my one and only duel mate. Your destined duel mate? What are you You'll talking see? about? Uh, duel! I flip summon prediction princess Koinarma! Flip summoning is when you summon a monster by flipping it from face down to face up. I play my spell prediction ritual! I ritual summon prediction princess Terra Ray! I don't like the looks of this. I have to win. Making the Junior Arc League Championship will put me on the path to becoming a pro. I'm taking control of this duel starting now! Swing far, Pendulum! Carve the Arc of Victory! Five monsters at once? I got some goose pickers! Terror Ray will tell your fortune. And your fate. Looks like my Terror Ray has selected the tower right side up. This card foretells destruction, downfall, and works tragedy. Forfeit this duel, Yuya! If you choose to continue, this will be the last duel of your life! right now but I still have monsters and as long as I have them I still have a chance this is your final warning forfeit this duel now Yuya or this will be the last duel you'll ever have you don't scare me I end my turn but I'm never quitting this duel then my conscience is clear you will regret this I draw it's a monster card This can't be good! I wonder what kind of monster it'll be this time! I activate another one of Prediction Princess Terra Ray's special abilities! This ability flips Prediction Princess Petal Elf from face up to face down! Go full sleep! All these moves are starting to flip me out! You is in big trouble! None of Yuya's monsters have more than 2,400 defense points, and Terra Ray's got 2,600 attack points! It can destroy any monster at once! Now I'll end my turn. <gasps> Don't be shocked. There isn't any need for me to attack you right now. Nothing will change the fact that your destiny's already been sealed. Uh, yeah? Well, I'm gonna prove you wrong. Now I draw. Yeah. I'm 
changing things up and switching odd eyes from defense mode to attack mode. That won't help you. I activate Terror Ray's special ability. I can flip my face down monsters face up in attack mode. So you can switch your monsters face up or face down whenever you want? That's right, because Prediction Princess Terra Ray can control any card's destiny. Next, Petal Elf's special ability activates. Now, your mighty Odd Eyes is switched back to defense mode, joining the rest of your monsters. And don't forget, they can't change to attack mode this turn. Uh, just great. If you use monsters or stuck in defense mode, he can't attack during his turn! Ah, maybe such ghost predictions are coming true! Next up, Prediction Princess Astro Morrigan's special ability activates. At the end of this turn, say goodbye to your doomed monsters in defense mode. They'll all be destroyed. Ugh. And it gets worse, Yuya. It takes 200 points of damage for every monster that it destroys. Now I see why she didn't attack last turn. It was so she could use this special ability to deal even more damage. Even before I played my very first card today, Yuya. My victory was destined to happen. That... that can't be true. Oh, but it is. The truth is clear. You have no choice but to face it, Yuya. You're heading for total destruction! Destruction. There's not much time left for you. Your only chance to rewrite your future is to surrender now. Surrender? No, not good. Yuya is paralyzed by his opponent's prognosis. In my crystal ball, I see disaster is looming. The I Ching sticks have made it crystal clear that they must stop this duel immediately. The cards reveal an unchangeable dark fate. I place one card face down and end my turn. And now, Astro Morgan's special ability activates, destroying all your monsters! monsters aren't gone for good. They go to my extra deck. I don't think you get it yet, Yuya. I've been warning you because I'm trying to save you. You need to stop fighting back now, or you will never duel again. <sighs> I'm just wasting my breath. So be it. Terrorize special ability activates. All my monsters put face down. I don't know what she has planned, but my trap Performa Pal Call will protect me. If I take a direct attack, this card will block it, and I can add two Performa Pals from my deck to my hand, as long as their combined defense points equal the attacking monster's attack points. Since Petal Elf and Astro Morrigan are face down in defense mode, only Tower Ray can attack. And since my trap will stop that attack, I'm swinging this duel my way. Give up, Yuya. Huh? It's no use. The longer we duel, the worse your fate will be. This action card will prove I'm right. Just as I... I'm activating the action spell Block Draw! Now you can't draw until you send one action card to the graveyard. This really stinks. The card is obviously commanding you to stop fighting and finally accept your destiny. The only intelligent thing to do is surrender. If I quit now, my dream will never come true. And I'll never be a pro. He still won't believe me. The only way to save him is to end this duel quickly. But to do that, I first have to prep my strategy. With this! My face down card.
card is the Trap Reverse Reuse. It summons two flip monsters that are in my graveyard to Yuya's field in defense mode. And once this trap activates, I can use my Prediction Princess combo to end this duel before tragedy befalls him. And Yuya won't be harmed in any way. It is a race against fate. One Yuya needs me to win. Because if I fail, Yuya's future will come crashing down! Sorry, but there won't be an encore! My fright for bears giving you the hook. Go pummeling pop! Which means all of my life points are going! Bye-bye! I did it! My sixth win in a row! Great work! You finally get to enter the Junior Arc League Championship! Well, with my skills, getting into the championship was never in doubt. Sora, I seem to have misplaced... Come on! We have to hurry or we'll totally miss Yuya's duel! Ah! Now it's my turn! You can't draw until you send an action card to the graveyard! Yeah, I know! I'll get one! Ah! I was too late! I couldn't defeat him fast enough, and now this really will be the last duel he ever has! It's hopeless! And you're putting yourself in very serious danger! Open the path to a future that was closed. I send one action card to the graveyard to unlock lock draw. It comes down to this. One card decides it all. I draw. Polymerization? This is Zuzu's card. How to get in my deck? Oh, when I was scrambling and I knocked the cards off my desk. It must have gotten mixed up with all my cards by mistake! My whole future depended on this draw! Why did I have to get a card that I can't use?! Whoa! What was that?! Gentlemen! <laughs> scale 1 Stargazer Magician and Scale 8 Time Gazer Magician are already in their places! Now I can summon monsters from level 2 through 7 all at the same time! Swing far, Pendulum! Carve the Arc of Victory! My monsters are ready to swing into action! Encore performance! Traveling all the way back for my extra deck, give it up for my monsters! Yuya's going to put on a show! Yeah, maybe. Hmm. That was pointless, Yuya! Watch and learn as my terror ray once again flips over my face-down monster! Thanks to Petal Elf's special ability, all the monsters on your field switch to defense mode! She's doing the thing again! I'm glad you escaped your-
your destiny of destruction. Now I feel free to defeat you without holding anything back. At the end of this turn, Astro Morrigan's special ability will destroy all your monsters in defense mode, and you'll take 200 points of damage for each one. You only have 300 life points left, so when that happens, it's all over for you. You can't defeat me! You'll lose this duel and never make it into the championship! Well, we'll see about that, won't we? Huh? See about what? First, I activate Performa Pal Spring Goose's special ability. By banishing it from my graveyard, I can return two cards on my field to my hand. So come on back, Stargazer and Time Gazer. Next, I tribute Performa Pal Kaleidoscorp to summon level five Stargazer Magician. Looks like we got here just in time. And now... That card! I activate the spell card Polymerization! What's this? You use fusion summoning? and Odd Eyes Pendulum Dragon! This is it! The moment all you dual team and fans have been waiting for is here! Stand up, make way, and get set to cheer! I Fusion Summon! Ladies and gentlemen, now taking center stage, please give it up for the spotlight stealing Brood Eyes Pendulum Dragon! to you, but I think your fortune-telling days are over. Cause here's a little something you never saw coming. When I fuse a spellcaster to form Runei's Pendulum Dragon, the number of times my Runei's can attack depends on that monster's level. That can't be! You fused God Eyes with Stargazer Magician! Stargazer's a level 5 spellcaster! And that means Runei's Pendulum Dragon can attack you three times! And now, it's showtime! I got lucky, I guess. Where did you get that polymerization from? It's yours. Sorry, but it got mixed up in my deck by accident. Here, it's all yours. 
You've been training so hard with Sora, I couldn't imagine you not having this for the championship. And you're gonna need it, cause after I win my next duel, you might have to face me! And I won't be holding back my pendulum power, that's a promise! <laughs> calling you her dual mate? Well, you see, it's kind of a long story, Zuzu. Oh, you're such a cutie. Just tell her! <laughs> tell her! You, yeah? Zuzu, you gotta let me explain! We are meant for each other! It's our destiny! Destiny? I'll show you destiny! Zuzu, no, don't listen! For one who creates his own path, any kind of destiny can await. What's this? Get back here, you! You two-faced! Here you kids! I want you to meet my mom and dad right away! Where should we have the wedding? Preferably somewhere with an escape hatch! 